Or or just TV. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, I'm Tim. And I'm Bob. And I'm Spencer. This is the Board Game Rundown. Today, we're going to review Bonsai from DV Games. Mm -hmm. In Bonsai, we are trying to cultivate our own bonsai trees. Yep. And it's uh, pretty easy. I'm sure not in real life, but <laughs> but in this game, it's they pretty easy. They make it easy. seem so easy. You're gonna, <laughs> you've got a, a, a pile of tiles here. Uh, you know, they could be uh, wood, they can be leaves, and there are yep. flowers, leaves, and there's flowers. fruit. And so in this game, Fruit. you're going to do, you, you basically get to do one of two actions. Yeah. You are either going to, uh, you're going to, you're going to cultivate, which means you're going to add tiles from your pool to your tree, or you're going to meditate, which means you're going to take one of these cards from the tableau. And it is either, it could be a growth card, which is going to give you more tiles you can play. Or not, it's not going to give you more tiles. It's going to allow, allow you, you to play, play more, more tiles. tiles. It could be a tool card, which will allow you to hold more tiles it could also be a master or a helper mm -hmm. card, right? So the master is going to give you a bunch of tiles. The helper is going to allow you to play more tiles. It's, yeah, it's they a, place them immediately. Yeah, it's kind yeah. of a minor cultivate yep. action, mm -hmm. right? Like because you're not going to get to do your whole Full cultivate, cultivate, but it it's, lets you play a couple extra tiles. Yeah, yeah but you may also get something for it, or maybe you have the uh, the thing gets you extra points for it. Yeah. Right, mm -hmm. right, and and you're going to play basically until the deck runs out, yep. Yep. and then everybody gets one more turn. And yeah, there are parchment ones. They're called parchment. These are the ones that give you extra points for different things you've got. And uh, I mean, it's it's pretty straightforward. Yeah. The yeah, very jumped right into it. Basic rules are that wood has to be touching wood when, as far as tile placement goes, right? Yep. A leaf has to come off of wood. Mm -hmm. A flower has to come off of a leaf. Yep. And the fruit has to come off of two leaves. Right. And it can't be touching other fruit. Right. And then the leaves are going to score, or the um, flowers are going to score for each side that it is <laughs> excuse me not sharing a space with something yeah. else right yep. each open side and, yep. yeah one of the neat things is that it, even on the art uh it kind of <laughs> says that so like you can kind of see the leaf it's green it might not show up too well but there's that and then when you place the flower it has one side of green on it so you know it has to be touching the leaf and then when you have two leaves the fruit's got two Green yeah, side. two sides, yeah. right? Very nice so, to do that. Yeah, it was a great art design. So yeah, re just really smart design that tells you exactly, you know, how, what is a legal play. It comes with the best play rate ever because it is just a very simple way to tell you how things yep. are scored. How things score at the end of the yep. game, what they're worth. Wood's nothing. Wood ain't worth nothing. Worth nothing. But uh, yeah, I mean, it's pretty straightforward. We learned and played this in under half an hour. Yeah, oh, you know, with, mm -hmm. with three players. And there's a, a... I learned to play this as he was setting it up and taught them how to play it. Yep. Yep. <laughs> there is a, uh, a fascinating thing in the back of the book, which talks about the actual, uh, uh, bonsai. actual, bonsai, actual bonsai cultivation. Bonsai yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, looks like lots of different solo modes are in there. So you're just trying to achieve different goals. I have brown thumbs. I couldn't do that. IRL? Not happening. Yeah, no. <laughs> no in exactly. theory. Yeah, in yeah theory. I like theory. the soul scenarios because they're not just typical. They have a whole bunch of different things you can do. Um, depending on, they, they call them after the season. So you've got spring, summer, winter, and then this emperor challenge, which has two boards. I want to try that one. Sure. That, it looks cool. It is a cool. You're a glutton for punishment. Yep. <laughs> uh, all right, let's get into components. All right. Okay, so components are they're pretty straightforward, right? Mm -hmm. uh, you've got this real thick, chunky board. Everybody's got one in their player color. Yep. Four four different ones. The cards are really nice stock. You wouldn't need to sleeve these because they don't get shuffled and handled a lot. Right. Only like you on pick setup. it up, you look at it, you put it down. Yeah. It's pretty much what happens with it. And and but the card art, the iconography is really solid. The mm -hmm. tiles are nice and thick. I don't think there's any problems with those. Nope. I think the iconography throughout the game, like the design, as Bob was pointing out with yep. the tiles, I think is just solid. Oh, mm -hmm. Just yep. solid. Yep. The, only, straightforward. the only one that caused us uh, pause and really shouldn't have is this one here. Um, this goal is just got lines on it. And at first we didn't know what it means. But then, you know, you look at it closer, you're like, oh, it means you go off the side. It goes yeah. underneath and off the side. And you have to do it on opposite sides. Yep. Um, but it, is, it does break it down super clear in the book. Yes, it does. Yep. Totally. Uh, look at the back. Yeah, got, got, a good, got a good breakdown of it. And, and one thing we didn't talk about in the overview, right, of the game, but the um, little goals, the way these tiles work oh, is is when you meet the goal, mm -hmm. you can choose to take it or you can forsake, forsake that it tile. Forsake it forever. forever, forever. But that means you're just trying to go for a higher goal. Correct. Yep. And and so but then if somebody snakes out and grabs the one you're going for, SOL. Yep. So strategically, right, it. you have to really. 
kind of pay attention to those yeah, because see what everybody else is doing. Because you could miss out on some easy right? points. Oh, Tim, look like he's way far away, but he's got like eight play cards over here. He's like, yeah, I'm just so far away from that. Mm -hmm. blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Oh, no, I, I just got. I took the risk. Yeah. And I didn't go for the big for the small one. I was going for the big one, and then I noticed he has. Oh my gosh, how much growth! <laughs> but he only had two wood. But so I didn't have enough wood. Place to get it yeah. Yeah. And yep. so he decided to take that one instead of take another turn. Yep. And that was yeah. Yeah, that I was, like those choices like that. I love those. Yeah, yeah it's, it's pretty good. My biggest two beefs with the components is that uh, this player board and the other player board look virtually identical to me because the colors, but yeah, it's so the irrelevant. The purple and the blue look yeah, identical. very, very similar, but it doesn't matter. The player color doesn't matter. Right, because it's not like these are pieces we're putting out. Right? Correct. So yep. there's, no the color real pot, so there's no real confusion with that. And the other thing is they use this, they kind of recycled a lot of the same art on some of the cars, mm -hmm. which would have been neat to see some different art, but I mean, it, it's fine. Yeah, they, all the oh, yeah. master and yeah. the worker yeah. art is the, the same. same. Art. And even like uh, a lot of these are like the same type of art too. Well, right? sure. I mean, that, that or that like fruit. Fruit one's always the, fr the fruit. The yeah. leaf one looks like yep. leaves. Yep. I guess yeah. for me, because it gets covered up. It's not as big a It deal. doesn't. Right. And you display a, over the top of it. And the game is yeah, so can... fast right. and yeah. light. I mean, mm -hmm. I'm, not, I'm not trying to knock, knock your nitpicks. It mm -hmm. didn't even occur to me because the game just. Kept going. Just kept well, I noticed it when two of the masters came out and they're identical. So I kind of like went, I was kind of like paying attention to see, like, oh, oh okay, sure. yeah, the workers are all the same too. Right. But because they give you different resources, different re -resources on the different on, master cards. Yeah, correct. And I also thought just, it doesn't mean anything, but there's a little gold thing in the corner of here. It's called Kintsugi. I'm like, but it mentions it in the back of the book. That's if that, any of you know. Something. If this does something in the game, let me know because I haven't been able to figure it out. Yeah, but but that Probably is called the, out in the solo. That is the Japanese art of repairing like broken things, With but making gold, it beautiful. Make them better, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, making it beautiful. I love mm. that they added that for no reason. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's a little cool. touch. Yeah. yeah, it's a pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, overall, I think the components are really good for this kind of game. Mm -hmm. I think it gives you everything you need without being uh, overproduced. Yep. But it's definitely oh, not underproduced. Right. You know, it it it's might still produced. be it might still be a little <laughs> overproduced. I mean, it's very well produced. Yeah, yes, yeah. we'll do that. Well produced. Well, well produced. produced for for everything that that is in here. I think you said mm. the one problem we had was a sticky, uh, almost sticky, but not. Quite yeah, the sticky. brand new cards, like the cards, just want to kind of stick together yeah. a little bit. But I mean, once you play deal. through it once, I'm sure it's not going to be. Nearly yeah, as I was kind of like bridge shopping them a little bit yeah. just yeah. to try to get them to you know, break them in just a little bit. But I didn't have anything else. Yeah, no. I think that's pretty really much good. it for components. The, the book, yeah, your rule book. Is the shape good? Don't care much for the shape, <laughs> although it's a small square. So even when you open it up, the the yeah. you know. It's the not footprint huge. is not huge. It has everything that, that we needed. We didn't have any questions. Literally, yeah. the, the, the instructions are basically just on those four pages. The rest is solo game and information on bonsai trees. Yeah. And then um, the back And is it seems back. like the question that we, that we had was answered, you know, yep. super easily. So The only one that we, we, we made a decision on was uh, if you can't play something, mm -hmm. then you have to prune until you can place it. Mm -hmm. But if you then prune away one of the leaves that a fruit is touching, does the fruit fall off? We that decided... No, because it doesn't say it has right. to stay. It just says it has to be placed. It says, Correct. right. It said placed. Right. Not, so it doesn't say always have to be touching. Right. right. Yep. It yep. just says when placed needs to touch. Yep. Yeah, because one of the things when you're cultivating, you're like, oh, man, I have this leaf here, and I kind of want to make that wood a bit longer. And so you can just pull tiles off because you're pruning it. And so we're like, well, if I prune that leaf, is that going to make the fruit fall off? But it, exactly. we ruled it no because it just says placed. It was placed correctly. We just trimmed around it. Yep. Right, so and if that was okay. wrong, I don't think it ruined anybody's game. No, I don't. Think you know, so. I, I, I honestly, yeah. it, this game is so light, so breezy, mm -hmm. and also, uh, it came up one time. It's right. not like everybody yeah. was like constantly like pruning, pruning off. Right, right. You know, and also there's just not enough time for that. Oh, you know right. what I mean? There's just not enough turns. I was mm -hmm. expecting it to be a longer game than it was. Yeah. No, it was yeah, very short. Yeah, no, but not. I mean, it, this was one of those games where it's like I need another turn. Yep. Yeah. You know, but what's the time on the box say? 40 minutes. 40 minutes. That's a bit long. It usually doesn't go that way. Usually it's like, you know, oh, it's the 30 minute game two hours later. Right. You know, right. <laughs> but well, yeah, it's... well, let's get into let's get into final thoughts then since we're All kind right. of All past right. components. Sure, sure. Spencer. Yes. What did you think of Bonsai? I actually enjoyed it quite a bit. Um, I can. Try to pay attention to what you're doing and try to, to stop you, or I can just totally ignore what you're doing and just go for what I want. Um, and I think both strategies uh, pay off. Yeah, well. I, yeah. There's no like take that or anything, but you can try to rush maybe an objective. Right. Yeah, yeah. You could hate draft a card, but again, the game is so short that if that card doesn't benefit you, you're losing a turn. I right. literally hate drafted one card at the beginning of the game, and since it was the beginning of the game, I don't think it mattered. Uh, the beginning of the game doesn't matter. There's no <laughs> yeah. strategy there. Well, he had all these, and like, oh, I take this one, doesn't get any points for it, but eh, right. whatever. Yeah. Yeah, it, it's not a, a major deal. Um, it's it's relaxed. 
play with your friends. Uh, I like that it's solo and it has all these different solo scenarios that I really want to try. Yeah, because setup will be super easy to oh, yeah. play a easy. solo mm -hmm. game of this really fast. What do you think, Bobby? Uh, yeah, I dig it. Um, a nice little tile laying spatial game. I enjoy those. Um, sort of like an engine builder with like the extra cards you can lay out on the side to help you like, like hold more resources or play more resources out in one turn. Um, I really love like the push or luck element on mm -hmm. the should I you know forsake this and try to move right. on to the next one because uh, man I knew Spencer was getting close and he almost beat me the one time and then we realized oh, it has to be on separate sides side, and I was yeah. like all right I better just take this next lower level one because that's as far as I'm gonna be able to get because I wasn't taking the play extra one right. I was just kind of building a little bit each time um, but I was trying to get as many resources as I could and yeah I just I, I really liked all the little kind of things about it and for like a short thirty minute uh, little game it's it's great. Yeah, I, this was fantastic. This mm -hmm. was I I this wouldn't have been a game I sought out, mm -hmm. but um they sent it to us, you know, hey, if you want to if you want to play this. And I'm like, well, "Okay, yeah, sure, I'll try it," right? Mm -hmm. But it, you know, it, immediately it's beautiful, the components are nice, and then the play The gameplay is simplistic. Is and, is easy. Yeah, but still like but yeah. Yeah. interesting and, choices. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And you know, by its very nature, it's balanced. Um, we had the two of us we were very close in score. Mm -hmm. uh, I think Tim probably I was just, trying to he was trying a strategy that didn't quite I didn't, pan I out, didn't but. if I had more turns. <laughs> yeah, you would have crushed us if I you could, had a few more turns. That, yeah. yeah. I would have had I would I just started to get an engine going. I drafted too many of these yeah, cards. Too many of and those. I did not have enough resources to warrant that, right? Yeah. Um so you need balance. I need balance. <laughs> but again, first game doesn't count unless you win. Yeah. So Yep. Yeah. So, so, so Spencer counts. and I barely played this. Yeah. You know, like, Bob's, Bob's counted, but only by like three points or five. something. It was pretty close. Yeah. It was but who's counting? I was. And I, and <laughs> I also one hundred five to one ten. At the end, <laughs> at the end, you, you have a little bonsai tree. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I Adorbs. Just found this a, a very satisfying yeah. uh, game experience. I thought this was really good. Kind of came out of nowhere. Not and, stressful, right? No. It's one of those yeah, things just, just very like you know, kind of like pruning a bonsai tree. You know, you just. I want to have some trickling water in the background. Yeah, meditate. <laughs> expansion. While we're, yeah. while we're waiting between the turns, app is you've just got a little trickling water. You've got a little Zen garden. Yeah, you know, yeah, there the you go. Oh, rock garden. Yeah. Little rakes and stuff. Yeah, just, yeah. <laughs> so get on it, DV Games. All yeah. right, let, that's the deluxe version. <laughs> yeah, there you go. That's All funny. right, let's get into final, final scoring. scoring. Bobby. Yeah. How do we do final scoring? Uh, so we're each going to give this a rating from 1 to 10, including point fives, and, and then we're going to take those scores. We're going to average them together in the wizard machine and, the, <laughs> and uh, tell you our average. That'll be the score you see from the board game rundown on things like BGG. And uh, do we put them on our Discord at all? Uh, sure, maybe. maybe. But that'll be the score that the board game we rundown We would if you asked. Yeah. <laughs> we, we would if you asked. Well, we'd then go watch the video. That's right. <laughs> Link to the video. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, Spencer. Yeah. What rating will you give Bonsai? Uh, have you only played this once? Um, I'm going to give this an eight. Right on. I like it. And I would love to try the solo and see if that would change my rating. Sure. Sure. Probably improve it. Probably. I would guess. I would guess. Not like, oh, the solo mode on this is so bad, I'm dropping this <laughs> half a point. I mean, because you would just ignore solo mode. Yep. Uh, Bob, what you got? Um, so typically I would dock something a half point from the player colors being virtually identical, but since it doesn't matter, I'm not going to bother docking it. And I'm going to give it the eight that I think it deserves. I agree with that assessment. <laughs> I also will give it an eight. You want to average uh, that all together? Yeah, I need the magic wizard machine to yeah. make it an eight. Yeah, this, <laughs> this is a really solid, yeah. like, filler, mm -hmm. family oh, weight yeah. game. Yep. You know, like, it, it would be filler for, for game nerds like us. Right. Oh, yeah. uh, at a game night, we're waiting for somebody wait for to show the, up. Wait for to show up in the right. over here. Right, right. Yeah. Or... Or you go to, you know, the in-laws or family for yeah. a holiday yep. and you're like, hey, I got this cute little game. Mm -hmm. This is not intimidating at all. Nope. And it's not mean, you know, it's right. just. Yeah. And, and the concept some... works the way you think it would, right? Oh, you're growing one in the woods, expanding the wood. Oh, look, now leaves are coming out. And I can eat a fruit or I get a flower. Yeah. Right. And if someone walks by the table and you're all playing, you know, there is a certain amount of table presence to this thing. Yeah, I agree. Nice looking. Mm -hmm. I agree. Yeah. Your trees look really cool by the end. They do. So, unless it was mine. No, mine actually <laughs> looked pretty decent. <laughs> it did really look good. My, it worked like six, points. 60 points worth. <laughs> yeah. It was, it was 68, 68 points. To be fair. <laughs> I was happy with it. It yeah. was my little tree. Sure. Uh, exactly. The people I, were play, I was playing against, uh, they got like zero points. So, oh, I did wow. pretty good. Yeah, look at player four. Zero. <laughs> yeah. Loser. <laughs> totally wasn't me. Yeah. I didn't come in last. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, strongly recommend Bonsai. Yeah. Tons of fun. Check this out. Mm -hmm. uh, very nice, light, easy breezy game. Mm -hmm. So for the Board Game Rundown, I've been Tim. Bob. Spencer. I'll see you next time.